What's up guys, Curtis here and welcome to an absolutely massive player review. Today we are reviewing the team of the season. Ben Teke only came out last night at 6pm. I'm trying to get it done and uploaded within 24 hours and I think I should be able to get that done. But as always we're going to look at some real life stats, some in-game stats, a full list of his in-game stats, some gameplay and then we'll go on to give him an overall rating. But before we get started what I do want to say is if you want a fast and reliable coin service check out utcointraders.com. There's a link to them in the description. So let's go. So, his name is Christian Benteke. He's a striker. He comes from Belgium. He plays for Aston Villa in the Barclays Premier League. He's six foot three, vaguely in height and costs around 390 coins at the time of recording on Xbox 360, maybe more or less in the future and on PS3. Some of his key in-game stats is his 99 finishing, 99 strength, 99 shot power, 88 sprint speed, 86 heading. He also only has a, uh, he has a four star weak foot, not only has a four, but has a four star weak foot, but only has two star skill moves. In terms of his full list of in-game stats, you can see some great ones there, 83 ball control, 81 dribbling, 86 heading accuracy, 84 long shots, 80 short pass, 79 penalties. These are ones that I hadn't mentioned in his key stats. I think he had 87 volleys as well. Uh, he is very strong and very big, uh, his strength being his main amazing stat at 99. He's also really quick as well with good pace indeed. I think he has 86 average card pace. Now, um, you are going to see in these clips a lot of goals from corners. It was not even normal, the amount of goals that he scored from corners. It was like it seemed to be every game there'd be one goal from a corner. And I, I tried to split them up a bit, spread them out because there were so many of them. But with his brilliant height, his incredible strength and all that great stuff, he was getting on the end of headers every single time. It was unbelievable. But he has some incredible physical stats with 84 acceleration and 88 sprint speed, as well as the 99 strength, which is incredible. Incredible. Uh, sadly, the biggest letdown for me is the only two star skills, it means you can't do roulettes, you can't do chops, you can't do stuff like that. But you can get past it with his uh, amazing strength. The uh, 99 strength, uh, I think, makes him just the second player after Infor Mac and Fenwell to have 99 strength. But uh, it means that with that, you can literally just like shrug players off without even needing skills to beat them because you just run into them and that would push them out of the way. Uh, he's got, like I said, the incredible heading stats. Uh, it's very tall and uh, jumping isn't half bad, So as well as the heading accuracy that are always on target. 83 ball control, of course, helps towards his strength, meaning he can keep it close to his feet whilst also. Uh, pushing everyone off. He's got an incredible shot with the 99 finishing and 99 shot power. He's got great long shots as well, 84 long shots. Um, decent short passing, but not nothing like outstanding. But like he is what you want your striker to be. A clinical finisher who can get on the end of through balls. He can get on the end of every cross. He can get onto basically any form of ball. He's a very well-rounded player. All he doesn't have is the skill. So uh, everything else he has down to a T. So he is literally the perfect striker. Of course, he's ridiculously expensive at 300 and what was it? 390k at the time of recording. So he isn't cheap at all. But he is still very, very good indeed. So we're coming up towards the end of it now. In the second, I am going to pot on the screen my overall rating of him and that is 9 out of 10. I found him to be absolutely fantastic. One of the best strikers I've used on the game would score in any situation and was an absolute solid beast. I will be getting up. Uh, the team that I used him in, a squad builder, will be coming up in the next few days. I've also got four more of this team of the season, maybe even more uh, reviews coming up, so definitely check your sub boxes for that. Subscribe to this channel if you haven't already. Leave a like if you enjoyed this video. Thanks as always for watching guys and I'll see you next time. Bye bye.